right, so problem number 21 of section 1.1.1 asks us to find the equation of the secant line of the function j of z equals z minus 1 times z minus 2 on the interval 1 to 2. Now, we're going to leave this, um, leave the equation in slope-intercept form, which you're probably used to seeing as y equals mx plus b. However, we have a function j of a variable z, not a function y of a variable x. So, using these variables, the equation for our line is going to be of the form j equals mz plus b, where m is our slope. Now, the slope is going to be equal to the change in j over the change in z, which is you know, the same thing as the average rate of change. In fact, that's just another interpretation of the average rate of change is the slope of the secant line between on the inner secant line of the function on the on a given interval is the same as the average rate of change on that interval. So on the interval one to two, we first uh, want to take find j of two. So this is equal to two minus one times two minus two. Which 2 minus 2 is 0, so this whole thing ends up just 0. Now, j of 1 is going to be 1 minus 1 and times 1 minus 2, which again is just going to go to 0. So our slope is going to be 0 minus 0 over the change in z, which is 1, but the whole thing is just going to go to 0 anyway. So we know that our line is going to be of the form j equals 0 times z plus b, or just j equals b. So last step in the problem is figure out what is b. Now the, um, the equation of the secant line is going to be just a constant function, meaning that no matter what value for z I stick in here, we're just going to get out b. So it's good enough just to check it for a single value of z. But we've already done that actually twice here. So we can just take our computation for 2, for j of 2, see that that's 0. So therefore, b must be 0. We see that this also makes sense because if we were to take 1 instead of 2, we also get 0 and gives us the same answer. So I'll write over here. final answer for the equation of the secant line of this function on the interval 1 to 2.